Um, and power can also be, so I may be the CEO, you may be the CEO, yeah. and you have power, um, and you can use your power in a very light way, transparent, open, everybody knows, yeah. or it can be in a little bit more dark in that context, right. behind the scenes, yeah. no one knows what's going on, people feel like they get shafted. Yeah. So yeah. the culture that I carry as the CEO will determine how politics and power plays out in right. an organisation. It's very interesting. Can I just um, ask a quick question uh, while you're there? <clears throat> it's a very interesting view of uh, politics. Um, sort of defining it as the process of influence makes me think in that sense it's very similar to leadership. I mean, you would think as leadership as being process of influencing people to meet objectives, yep. overcoming challenges to meet objectives. So in that way, um, you know, is politics part of every organisation? And if it's so similar to leadership and influence, um, are there organisations that aren't political? Well, if, if, um, if we define, it depends how we define politics, because politics is a very important part of our society. Yep. And it's a very important part of the democratic process here in Australia. And we need those people to represent us. And how well we're represented is determined by the democratic process. Yep. But as we all know, sometimes politics is ugly and it's not something that we're proud of. And we often have politicians who we don't think represent us well right. and in entirety. But if we then if we then move politics to power, yep. and we say, um, we're t what we're going to talk about is the use of power in a good ethical mm. way that that embraces the idea that a leader is going to educate and direct in terms of strategic direction, and then where the people. So will will then be behind that strategic intent and we'll yep. all work as one. Right. And so as a leader, you need to make sure that one, there's clarity about where we're going. It's also clarity about why we're going to go there and yep. can we go there and do we have the capability to go there and there are systems to go there. Yep. So that the leadership task is that whole thing. Yeah, okay. Um, but once again, it's a demonstration of the power of the leader. Right, right. And um, we'll talk a little bit about culture, yep. individual people's own personal development yep. and how that links to culture and how it, an organisation may have multiple cultures within one organisation because one department could have one culture and another department based on the leader right. could have another department, right. another culture. Right. So it is a complex picture, right. yep. a little bit like political parties who are complex beings and sometimes you hear people with insight and depth who never attack anybody else in their process yep. you might see um, appear with a totally different style yep. saying the same thing but right. doing it in a in a way that denigrates everybody else right um, right so there is that is that sort of challenge 